right guys so i'm getting ready to show you guys what i carry like in my work bag so to speak just simply because during this um journey on this particular position that i'm kind of like temporarily in um we can't have like a big bag so more so they want us to have like a fanny pack or like a crossbody that is kind of like small in size dimensions lightweight whatever so and then also it's a good thing because it helps you you don't feel like you're being weighed down so okay so with that being said let me show you what i have in my work bag all right so this is just basically a coach fanny pack it is that very super durable leather uh quick tip if you're looking to get something from coach and you want you're kind of universal with the style, things of like that sort, and you want to do the leathers, go for the men's collection. So this is where I purchased this from. I purchased this from uh, the Minnesota Egan. No, I lied. No, I didn't lie. Uh, okay, Minnesota Egan Outlets. Um, if you ever go to Minnesota, they have outlet malls. So the one in Egan um, is the one I went to. They have one in Albertville, Minnesota as well. But this one came particularly from the one in Egan. And I purchased this before we left just to have a fanny pack. I wanted to get my hands on the Louis Vuitton like bum bag. But trust me, I'm not spending that much on a freaking bum bag. That is just ridiculous. So anyway, enough of that. So this is a coach um, fanny pack. But this, I'm not sure what the exact name. I'll try to link it below so you guys, if you're interested in this. They have an... I believe like a navy color, a black, and like a brown when I found it. So this one in particular, I think it was like 110 or something like that. So also, let me just throw this in there. If you're ever in Minnesota and you shop for like clothes and stuff like that, there's no tax. So that's the bonus from, from going there. So, okay. So I'm going to just start from the front and just show you what's in here. I like this because it is... What do you call this thing? I don't know. The little class pocket, whatever. So my line of service, periodically, um, I sometimes receive monetary gifts. So uh, this is a receipt because if you work in an airport, it's kind of hard during your downtime not to shop. So here's a receipt. Um, this is a dollar. I think this is like a receipt from, yep, it is. And I'm going to, this is a receipt. This is a receipt from the KFC. If you're interested to know how much, how much the combo costs. Oh, don't be trying to get my code. Hold on, wait. Oh, this is a KFC receipt. How much that beyond combo costs. Um, let's see what else we have in here. Oh, Pure All Single. Uh, this is a charger port. Um, because I carry a portable charger, but this is a, it's in here. And then I have like some, what is this? Some loose coin. So that's what's in this first pouch. And it's not super deep. I don't know if you guys can see that in there, but. It's deep enough. And over time, this was like super stiff when I first got it. I think I've had this bag mm, like a, under a year. But um, I've had this bag under a year. But what I have been doing is using it just for work. I wanted something that I wouldn't mind wiping down, spraying down with sanitizer or some natural something, a wipe or something like that. When I come from work, and of course you see, well, hopefully you can't tell me a little closer. There's a little, little discoloration on the, the snap here, the twist. But I don't really mind, honestly. <clears throat> you can, since this is probably uh, some good silver metal, you can always get something in, polish it up or shine it, paint it, whatever. Um, this was like a gun metal color, it's not black. All right, so on the outside, um, I'm a super advocate for clear. Uh, if you are a travelista like myself, 
and you travel very often, Clear is a great program. And I'll do a quick video on that and just kind of share your my experience with Clear, the cost, things of that sort. Anyway, these are perks that you get. Um, this is not the original sanitizer that comes in this bottle. I just use it as a refill at this point. But I and it comes with this little cool little yeah, the little snappy thing, whatever that thing is called, y'all. I don't know right now. Um, on the bag, so you can attach it to whatever you want to. So, so sometime when I travel, I'll attach it to my backpack or my carry-on. So there you go. There you have that. Um, we'll get into this front flap pocket real quick. All right. So I know y'all like, what in the heck is in here, Ashley? But <laughs> I'm just going to run through this stuff really quickly. I have a bunch of Ricola. These are the honey and lemon cough drops. They're not the tastiest, but they're good. They work wonders. I have some gloves in here. I don't know if y'all heard, but PPE is like super scarce. So sometimes we may get PPE at the beginning of our shift. Or sometimes you may not be around PPE um, throughout the day. So I keep my own. Like, why not? Um, there's a panty liner in here. Um, this is my power bank. I did purchase this from Amazon. And let me see if you guys can see the brand. It's upside down. This is the brand. Amazon.com. I got, I've got like a two pack for like, I don't know, 10 bucks, 12 bucks, something like that. There's a pen. Now, this is usually in my front flat, flat but I have also keep my own pen. I don't like using other people's pens now. My AirPods are in here because there is nothing like, well, one AirPod, I know the other one is. Um, there is nothing like being on break or driving to work or whatever you have, and you want to either watch a quick video on your downtime or you want to make a quick call or listen to music to kind of escape from all of what's going on around you, AirPods or that deal. Um, I have my Chanel. Let me see if I can get the number here. Is that, I believe that's 119. Yep, that's Chanel 119. It's like a mauve color. It's really cute. It's a lip gloss, by the way. I have my Louis Vuitton. This is the black Epi print leather card holder. I really like this thing, like a lot. <clears throat> oh, let's see what else we have in here. Huh. I won't be eating those. Those probably fell out. Some more coins, a Tylenol, some more cough drops. What's this receipt to? This is another receipt from the terminal something I purchased and I try to clean this thing every day but a band-aid because you just never know some more coins okay that's all that's in this flat and as you can see it doesn't open up a ton but upon using it I've noticed that the leather kind of stretches and flex it to what I want to do with it it does have this black flap here and let's go in and see what's in this back flap. All right, guys. So, more gloves. Yes, I go crazy. Okay, because I'm, I'm, ain't nobody can catch me off guard. I have some lotion. I think I got this from, like, Hilton property somewhere. Because that's pretty much all I stay at. Occasional Marriott here and there. But, because we wash our hands a lot, we got to keep some lotion. This is the extra KN95 mask. There's one, and then there's two. Um, this is, I have a bunch of these guys. Um, because I carry this fanny pack, if I ever have to go to the bathroom, which I try not to do number two at work, I know TMI, but even if an emergency, because sometimes you can't hold it, you know, on a long shift, or whatnot. I keep some cleansing wipes. Um, you can buy these online or whatever. But I got this from an old 
place that I used to go to in Minnesota when I went to my esthetician. She just gave me like a big box of them. So I don't know what she was supposed to, but yeah, I have those. More gloves. Um, I have an extra antibacterial anti anti wipe. These you can get from like Costco's. So I purchased these and you can get like a whole case of them. So that's where I got these from. And that is all that is in this back pocket. So that's everything that's in my work bag, guys. <laughs>